Ah, damn it. <sighs> you cut yourself? Like, really deep. It was just such a freak accident. I had a pocket knife in my bag and then just wasn't paying attention, just slid my hand in to get my keys and slid my finger straight down the blade of this knife. Where's the cut? Dude, that's it. Let's see. Possibly a stitch. Okay, so we've got, we're probably thir starting 30 behind, so we need to find a way to make up. Um, Adam just cut his finger. Oh, like, like, uh, like really real? bad. They're doctoring him up right now. <laughs> nope. If you apply pressure for a few moments, it will stop bleeding, and then we can put the alcohol. In the this ain't gonna stop bleeding. Stick. I mean, there's a ton of blood, but you know, like I'm, I'm not gonna leave right now to go to the ER to get this fixed because, like, I can't hold up this shoot anymore. All I'm thinking of is I'll take care of it later, and I feel like an idiot. I, you know, I just. That's Danielle. Hold on. Hello? Hey. Hey. You know, Blake had volleyball tryouts and stuff, and she's all, all me, work Japanese kiss, and I think she's having like a panic attack or like something. That's she's like, like she's having like an anxiety attack? You're just feeling really weird. I can't feel my body. And I'm like, well, you need to go to the nurse right now. And I said, get some water, sit down. And now she's nervous it's going to happen again. And then she'll just like, wait, you got this. And I just don't like how I can't fix it, you know? These are the, these are the moments that are tough. I mean, as a parent, you just, neither one of us are there makes me feel that being a bad mom, I can't beat it. So. I get it, don't beat yourself up. You, you wanna make it better, but Danielle's four hours away. I'm an hour and a half away and can't leave. Seems like we're always getting pulled in too many directions.